My name is Nelson. Welcome to Aggressively Sweet. What's cracking? How's your butts? So funny story. I literally, guys, I nailed the intro, one minute intro, and boom, I started the video. What video I was watching? IDS introdu uh, introduction to the seven, right? Now, unfortunately, I was like two minutes in. I was very, I wasn't too excited because there was a lot of reading instead of someone like narrating, um, which is fine. I don't mind. I was reading it. I was getting into it. And then boom, it showed me like, um, an RM solo music video. And I just, I instantly took my headphones on and then I realized that there's gonna be a lot of music. Um, and I, I'm not gonna watch it because it's gonna spoil so many songs. It's gonna spoil so many songs. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna watch my first RM solo, right? So what have I watched from solos? Uh, I've done, uh, the first one was Jimin. Just, what a sweetheart, right? I did Serendipity and Lie. Uh, amazing. I did some lives. I did, I don't remember. I did the music videos. Do, 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 do. Doesn't really matter. Then I did Jin uh, and then I did V, right? Have I done someone else and I'm forgetting? Maybe. Um, but yeah, I haven't done much, right? JK, I did like uh, one of his covers. Um, I know they're not solos and it was covers or like, you know, like for, for dramas, etc. But I've done like solos, you know, like uh, solos, sorry videos just for them so i think i think the time has come like so for rm my my my, my first impressions are that uh, or like my yeah like what i think um is that he is big brain right he's big brain and and he has big heart and and this is something about uh that i recently uh heard pied piper which is the song that i, I think he wrote so okay this is just a scenario right that it might not be right it might be fake but this has happened in a few songs i feel like potentially maybe rm started writing a song right and he took it like to to the producers or like you know to to, to the big boss and stuff they were like hey 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 come on man kim what are you doing and look what is this like this is this is not appropriate like this this young people that watch your, your music like oh okay but what if we had a part that it's like about their schoolwork and stuff and that they have to focus on school instead? Of, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like in a few songs, um, they've like, they've written, written, written. Like, you know, he he, he probably, I, I bet this guy has like so much, so many lyrics written, so much music that we never will, maybe never even listen to, you know? Because um, he has so much to give. And it, 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 it's amazing. I bet, um, I bet he's very happy with where he is right now. Uh, it was a, a, a um, it was amazing watching him in the Rise of Bangtan videos. Uh, watching him talk when he was young and he was saying about um, uh, how uh, Hitman, that's his name, right? Did I mess it up? I don't remember. But Hitman was like, you know, you, you need to uh, you need to not be reckless. You know, if you want to take this path, you need to not be reckless. And that's so true because RM may be in like in, in a different society and with different ruler, uh, rulers, wow, and different like people that um, are helping him out. You know, he could have ended up in a, in a very dark path where, you know, so much genius and just writing lyrics and going crazy partying, drugs, 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 drugs. And he could have been like on the streets fighting, whatever. You, you, you don't know, right? And it's, it's very good to see him uh, instead of ending in a path of absolute destruction through art, uh, ending up, you know, giving speeches in the UN. And, and being like this sort of uh, president of of, uh, of good faith, you know, like he's just so well spoken and it's like, um, it's amazing. His ramps are, are really, really good. They're not my style, uh, even though I've never heard uh, any of his songs by himself, right? But I feel like he's the kind of person that will probably spend more time making sure that everyone else is, every everybody else is absolutely perfect and then work on on his own, you know, maybe, I don't know, right? I don't know, because I haven't seen many videos. I, I, I honestly, I wish I could just watch that um, iDice video, but like, I, I don't want to watch like 30 seconds of a song, you know, uh, a song that's like, like 25% of a song. It's just, gonna, I, I don't want to, right? I didn't want to, I'm sorry. I'll, 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 so I'll, I'll go through the video and hear all the songs and then I'll watch the video. <laughs> Four and a half minutes, but I needed to, uh, this wasn't an intro, this was part of the video. I've never really spoken about RM and what I, I, I believe about him, and I don't know much about him. This is just my impression. Correct me if I'm wrong, or don't. It doesn't matter. So, RM Seoul, let's go. Very excited. Lyric video, but I think this is a music video. It better be. 
Is this a, is, am I being scammed? No, this is from Hive Labels. There's no scam there. What a voice, huh? Interesting play there. Love and hate relationship. What's behind it? It's always very interesting with RM's lyrics because... Because they're very, very multi-dimensional, you know, like... Um, and, and you know what? This is very interesting. Usually, uh, that's K-pop music, right? It's like multi-dimensional. Like, oh, what what do you like? Do you like uh, like EDM? Well, okay, well, we're going to have a song, and uh, it's going to be five minutes. 20 seconds of that is going to be EDM, so that's for you. Then 20 others is going to, you know, sometimes like... But um, I feel like RM's lyrics... BTS is not really like that, but RM's lyrics are kind of like that. It's like... It's like he writes what he wants and then he removes things or changes them in order to be like, okay, what if I was someone completely different than who I am? How would I see this? Would this fit for me? You know, and everybody can sort of see, not in all songs, but in a lot of them, they're like very poetic. Like if I read a poem and you read a poem, uh, it may be a completely different poem, you know, and, and that's beautiful. And that's very hard to do. It's very hard to do. And and it, it's, it's, um, those kind of uh, poems and lyrics usually i'm not saying that this is like some very deep lyrics or something i'm just talking about his lyrics in general that um these kind of lyrics they stand through um through time you know they stand through time it's kind of like um because the critics are always are always trying to figure out or like trying to see their point of view and and over the years they can always kind of adapt right um which is very cool very cool. Um, and also, I really love uh, songs about city, like songs about my city, you know, that, that I grew up. They kind of hit a little different. I've never been to Seoul. Uh, I'd love to. It's it's kind of, I used to want to go to Japan, but that's changed like seven years ago. I've decided, nah, nah, nah I got to go to Korea. I'm actually playing a Korean game right now, Super People. Oh, guys, I'm loving it. I think it's Korean. All right, uh, South Korean, obviously. All right, let's go. Yeah, it, it's it's a it's a weird one, right? Because it's literally that. It's like I love how disgusting you are. You know, like it's all there's a lot of backhanded compliments, but I get it. You know, like my city, I love. You know, like the stink of the sea. You know, not really, but. I love it. So you love it with the good and the bad kind of deal. Hey, any of you from Seoul?
Wait, the lyrics were always in the middle? That's awesome. I'm leaving you, leaving you. Yeah, I mean, he's kind of a master lyricist, isn't he? Master lyricist. Wait. Clip is this this part of the clip is so nice, huh? Hey, let's go, baby. You know, it's just so we. It's so it's so interesting how I got. I don't like this song. Like, realistically speaking, I don't like the song. You know, like this is not a song that I would be like. I'd hear it, someone would be like, oh, yeah. But, like, just sitting here and listening to it, it's just, like, it just gets you, you know? Like, it reaches you. You know, like, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful song. And the lyrics are very, 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 very cool. Cool is not the right word. They're very well crafted. He's a, he's a master craftsman, you know? Maybe he's not like the best dancer or singer or rapper or whatever, but like you have to give it him props to his um, to his brain, you know, like his brain is. And it was very interesting. What it was? Just, how funny was it? How funny was it? Oh my god, it was hilarious. Um, <laughs> on the rise of Bangtan episode one, they're like all sitting there. In the camera doing the diaries and like RM is talking about the future and like taking over the world or whatever and like how he needs to blah blah and then the next person I don't remember who was it was it Jin who was it was it JK and he was like it's cold it's really cold today <laughs> uh, you know I, I I honestly I I need I need like a whole documentary just about uh, is it Hit Hitman Bang right is that his name I need a whole documentary just for this guy because I think I think it's I think it's him you know like I think without him it's like he I don't know maybe it's all it's all like I'm just like idolizing this guy that I don't know nothing about right but it feels like if it wasn't for him having this vision, finding the absolutely perfect people uh, for each role and also guiding them through the years uh, for them not to turn into something that they wouldn't be proud of being, you know? Because it's not, it's not about, like, I think the whole, like, uh, mental health with, you know, with the superstars, it's not only just, like, Oh, I'm proud of what I've done because I've hit the charts. It's I'm proud because I've touched so many people, you know. And I feel like um, the big boss, he he kind of, you know, he like he kind of created it. He set it all up, you know, to to go. And and obviously, um, RM was like kind of like a, a keystone, right? Like a, um, the rock that everything kind of builds on that. And and it's amazing to see the freaking progress. Uh, very very cool. And um, oh, it's a good song. It's a good song. Mm -mm -mm. I love the video, you know. I, I, but of course, you guys know me. I think the ending was beautiful. But like generally, it's not like my kind of song. But I can still, you know. I can still really, really appreciate it. I loved watching this. And it kind of made me think of my own city, you know. This part over here, yeah. 
this 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 is so good yeah <laughs> Poet. Poet. So good. So good to see. So good to see. <sighs> Great stuff. Great stuff. <sighs> oh, damn. Oh, my God. It's 12 o'clock. Hey, Merry Christmas. It just became Christmas here. Oh, well. It is where it is. So, guys... Thanks so much for watching. Much, much appreciated. And, um, oh, Rise of Bangdan is going to be up tomorrow. I, uh, oh my God. And I've been spoiling it. I'm going to upload this now. I'm going to premiere it tomorrow morning because I want to. And I'm going to be off. But ignore all my spoiling of Rise of Bangdan. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Much, much appreciated. Rock and roll this. And Merry Christmas if, you know, whatever. It is where it is.